to talk. Talk? Why? Who sent you? What are you doing here? It's Dance. Paladin Dance. Don't you recognize me? Dance? No, 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 that can't be. Why... why are you here? I was dispatched to the Commonwealth on a recon mission, Paladin, just like yours. How did you find me? I've... I've been alone. All alone. For so long. We followed the distress beacons left by your team. Their holotapes led us here. The others? What, uh, What happened to them? I'm not sure. No, 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 I, I, I can't trust you. I can't trust you! This is the part of the job that I love. <coughs> Tango down! Brother, what? Freeze! One more step and I'll, I'll, I'll blow your damn heads off! Paladin Brandis? Who are you? Who sent you? How did you get in here? Calm down. We're just here to talk. Talk? Why? Who sent you? What are you doing here? It's Dance. Paladin Dance. Don't you recognize me? Dance? No, no, no. That can't be. Why? Why are you here? I was dispatched to the Commonwealth on a recon mission, Paladin, just like yours. How did you find me? I've... I've been alone. All alone. For so long. We followed the distress beacons left by your team. Their holotapes led us here. The others? What... Uh, what happened to them? They're dead, Paladin. I recovered their tags. You... you... You did? Thank you. This... this really means a lot to me. I tried to go back for them, you know. There was nothing I could do, not alone, but... But I'd hoped you've been through a lot to find me. I should... I should give you something. I've collected a lot over the years. Technology, odds and ends. If you see anything you want, take it, take it. Come back with us. You're still a member of the Brotherhood, Paladin. What? No, no, I couldn't. Not, not after everything that's happened. The Brotherhood needs you, Paladin. It's time you reported in. I, I, I can't. It's, it's been too long. I, I wouldn't be of any use. No one knows the Commonwealth better than you. We need your help. I've been here too long. I'm, I'm, I'm not myself. Would they still take me? Is that all? I live alone. Avoid other people. Everyone. Everything. What do you want? I could let you sleep here, I suppose. That's all right. Or, uh, or try the food. I don't have much, but if you're hungry. The only other thing I have is my gun, and... No, no, I still need it. I, I can't let you have it. The Brotherhood will honor the memory of your team. Shouldn't you be the one to tell their story? No, there's no going back. Not for me. Not anymore. Farewell, Brandis. Goodbye. And, uh... And... Thanks.
Look, just, uh, just take what you need and go. He's gone native. Damn it. Gone native? He lost his drive, his discipline. Even if he returned to the Brotherhood, he would never be the same. We've done all we can do here. Let's report back to the captain. Is that really necessary? I, I know this may sound like a strange question, but tell me, what do you think about Scribe Halen? She's as dedicated as they come, a real team player. I couldn't agree more, but I wasn't looking for an evaluation of her performance as a scribe. I wanted to know what you thought of Halen as a person. This isn't like you, Dance. Are you going to tell me what this is all about? I suppose I'm beating around the bush, because I don't normally find these discussions easy to handle. I'll try and get right to the point. The truth is, I'm worried about her. Since you and I are getting along so well, I felt like I could confide in you about it, to get your honest opinion. I appreciate that you value my opinion so highly. Tell me what's on your mind. Let me explain everything from the beginning. A few months before you found us, one of my men was shot multiple times by raiders. Halen stayed by that night's side for two days straight, without sleep, fighting to keep him alive. But he was on a slow decline. I decided that his suffering needed to end and ordered Halen to administer an overdose of painkillers so he could die with dignity even though I'm certain she wanted to continue fighting for that knight's life. <sighs> she injected him without question. She did the right thing. Of course she did. But the decision whether or not to ease that soldier's suffering isn't the point here. The point is what happened later that same evening. Halen approached me while I was on watch. She didn't say a word, but I could tell something was wrong. After what felt like an eternity, she collapsed into my arms, crying. I didn't know what to do, so I just held her for a while. A few minutes later, she stopped, kissed me on the cheek, and simply said, thank you, before heading back into the police station. Right then, it hit me. Maybe I pushed her too hard. I ordered her to ignore her instincts, to do something her medical training told her was wrong. That's why I'm worried about her, and for that matter, everyone under my command. Don't use Halen as an excuse. This is about you. Yeah. I suppose you're right. Look, four soldiers. Over half of my team are gone. Each one of them died because of decisions that I made. I understand the risks that come with the job. We all do. But how can anyone have confidence in me anymore? Hell, how can I have confidence in myself? The way you held... Halen tells me you care about them, and they care about you. I... I never thought of it that way. Well, it looks like things have taken a turn. I signed up to be your sponsor, so I teach you everything that I know. 
but it looks like I'm the one that needed the lesson today. All joking aside, I'm pleased that we had this discussion. And with all the problems you're facing, you still took the time to listen. It's comforting to know that I can speak to you as more than just your commanding officer. Next time you want to talk to me about yourself, try and be a little more upfront about it. I apologize for that. I've never had anyone who actually cared how I felt, so I have a difficult time opening up. Anyway, thanks for letting me get that off my shoulders. I think it's been weighing on me more than I realized. I'm only sorry you had to see me at my worst, instead of at my best. This is too dangerous. We're wide open out here. Damn, lost him. Victoria! <laughs> so quiet in here. I don't like this. That's how we do it in the Brotherhood. 